What up guys, I'm going to be doing a review of the um, Gator GM12 deck mold. Um, so yeah, let's get into this. Uh, um, I've, been ha I've had this for uh, since uh, last Christmas and it's February 25th at like 9 o'clock tonight. So yeah, it's February 25th, 2012. Um, so yeah, I got this like two months ago, so that's, a good, that's about a good time to review it. Um, it has about medium concave. Um, it looks deep, but it actually is medium. When you when the deck comes out, it's medium. Um, but yeah. Um, I think this is the... Yeah. And then, yeah, so there's that. So it has... Um, medium and then these are uh this is more of a like a high kick high kicks um so medium concave high kicks and about low dips so it's kind of like a berlin wood except berlin woods have like low kind of shape they have a low shape instead so like a lower concave shape but the dips are about the same, and the kicks, um, these kicks on the GM12 are a little bit, um, like, steeper. So, in a way, it's kind of like a Berlin wood. Um, all you have to do is just pretty much cut it like a Berlin wood, and you can sell it and make it, like, uh, uh, and make, like, 30 bucks off of it. But, um, yeah. There's that. Um, I really like this mold because it's, uh, easy to use, like, all you gotta do is put your, all you gotta do is put glue on it, put glue on your veneer, like, um, what, any kind, like, gator veneer, pro wood veneer, I think that's the only place, the only places that you can get them, but, um, you can get, um, I think molds at fingerdex.com and gator, so, yeah, go check out www.gatorfingerboards.com, um, so, yeah, because they're, they have some nice stuff there. They have some cool ramps, They're like a cool, um, like like a mini mini kind of um, half pipe thing. But yeah, there's this review. Um, I'd give it for like a deck. Like this is like exactly like how I would want a deck to be, like medium concave and like m like a little bit higher kicks. Um, that's like a Berlin kind of, um, and then for dips is like small, that's like, that's like the perfect deck for me, but, um, that's what I like, but, I don't like everything deep, I don't like, I, like, I don't like the extreme mold that well, I, I mean, I like, I like, I just don't like, I like the, con like the concave's good, I don't like the dips though, and it's too short, like it's, like, I can spread, I can spread my fingers out on it, and then like this one, this one just take, this one's like, yeah, see, so like, but, yeah, but, there's that, um, I'd give this about, like, for easy to use, about a 5, or 4.5, for easy to use, um, for, um, craftsmanship on this, I give it, I give it a 5, um, because they even carved in, I don't know if you can see that, GM12 in the bottom right here. I don't know if you can see that though. It's a red, clear, translucent, kind of opaque-ish. But yeah, I just heard something this way, like froze. Um, but yeah, there's that. Um, overall, I give this about a five, like four and a half, kind of four, four and a half to five. So. That's about it. Um, thanks for watching, guys. I'm going to try to put Gator Fingerboards down there in the um, description. So, thanks for watching. Hopefully, I'll remember that tomorrow.